Well, what's going on? <clears throat> it's the TEP episode one thirteen. Mm-hmm. Uh, we in here right now. Um, I had to cut that music off early. Uh, I've been getting emails <laughs> from uh, the. the um, yep, yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. I've been getting emails from them, so I'm trying to uh, trim it down. But anyways, we here episode one thirteen. You, you know, it's you on the mic. I got my brothers here to the left. I got my boy Boo. How you doing? Yeah. Call for me. I got Ed. How you doing? Oh. How y'all doing, man? How long has it been? It feel like it's been longer than a week. We definitely yeah. recorded last week. We it recorded did, last week, but we like... recorded on a Wednesday last week. Uh, oh, okay, okay, okay. So that was yeah. talking about usual Thursday. It's so, crazy yeah. how a day will make that scene. Because I'm like, Way oh. longer. Because I'm like, well, have you? It's been a little minute. Yeah, it's been it's, a little, and I feel like everybody had somewhere to go last weekend, too. Very so, active. Yeah. Very active. Yeah. I say everybody had their own little one, one two. two to make yeah. last week. Because mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I went to Vegas. Oh yeah, how was that? Uh, yeah, we were talking about traveling. Yeah, oh, was like, was traveling. Gonna say, cause, yeah, yeah was like, uh. it was what I thought it was going to be, man. I felt like okay, uh, no. what what I learned is the bigger the group, the more organized it got to be. Yeah, okay. The more organized you got to be, even from like if you got something you gonna do, you need to because people need to know. Okay, what time we need to be down in the lobby? Yeah, because it'll be like it was Ooh. just like chaos, and then you know how I measure my trips. How many? If I had to eat at a place more than once, unless it was just really fire and I wanted to double yeah. back. Oh, no. I know you don't like that. I ate at the no. same place three times. Oh, no. I know you didn't like that. And I it know was just a like... pizza place, bro. Oh, no. Uh, yeah. And it was literally just for the sake of convenience and so you don't have to think about where to go. Oh, yeah. man. So it was, it was okay. But, you know, I will say this. From my mm-hmm. – I'm 0 for 3 when I go to Vegas, but I finally – I learned – I can put together a good trip to go to Vegas. Now. Like I've learned from my failures. You know what to do. Yeah. yeah, I know like what we need to do and where we need yeah. to go. So it won't and be then you don't even need to be there that long because it's not. I mean, it's stuff to do, of course. But it's like if you want to be around our people and listen to hip hop, that kind of they really tighten the gap. It really yeah. shrinks, yeah. especially if you like really just out there to like turn up. And if you want to catch a show, then you might just extend it. But mm-hmm. yeah. you really just need to be in Vegas for two days. Vegas is definitely two days, two for, days. Sure, for sure. Like Vegas just sure. two days activity, two full yeah. days. Yes, yeah, like, yeah. And I don't even want to get out there on a Friday and then leave. I mean, like you can really go out there on some like get there early Saturday, go to the little yeah pool party, go out then. Yeah, you need two days in Vegas. That's it. But it was it was like I said, it was a good learning experience for me. And yeah, um, yeah that's what it was. I can be. That's my positive take on it. It was a good learning experience. I definitely want to go back, though. Like, I'm motivated to go back because, like I said, I seen some things. We didn't do it right, but Ooh. I see where it could be. And it kind of made me sad because I was like, man, I'd love if we could go out there. But Brotherhood trip? This not going to No, 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 2030. I'm about to say, I'm about to say, just to do our little simple trips, it'd be hard. So I, I'm about to say, I had to, I'm about to say, double so. back on yeah, the, the pay on somebody today. Yeah, just, I had so to call somebody. So I had to call to, two people. I'm about to say, so if you, yeah, that, that little, yeah. that, yeah, the Vegas price is different, bro. Yeah. yeah different. So that's why I was like, yeah. But it made me sad. I was like, man, we could really turn this up. We'd have a good time, but you know. Whatever. Well, Some of us ago. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think I can I could put together a group. Because you really need about ten. People? About ten. Mm. Yeah. Mm. We, about eight to ten. That's to make 10. stuff affordable. The group? <laughs> That's to make stuff affordable too by the BT. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. Cause I'm telling you, if you give me I need I can give you the time of your life in Vegas if you give me four fifty. Money That's it? money wise, four fifty. Mm. Oh. I need four fifty. Oh, man. Oh, I've had to cut. I'm just for me having to collect 160 and that taking nine months. That's why I say 450 is that'd be you have to tell people a year out. I was about to say it'll be next summer for sure. Or yeah, but I'm telling you, one. 450, we had the time of our lives. I'll give you 450. We had the time of our lives for 450. Yeah, I can get you 450. I can get you 450. That's going to get us three sections. Okay. And that's 10 people. 10 man. people. Ten people, four fifty. Yeah. Oh, you yeah, can take sure, eight to sure. ten, but yeah, four. Sure. You can be eight four fifty. I get your sure. time, yellow. That's why I said. That's why I I, I, I got the numbers got, figured out in my head already. That way, you got to change up the group. Mm-hmm. You really need ten. You need ten, like dedicated, because yeah. you need yeah. about six sections, about about fifteen hundred. Mm-hmm. So that's why I say that's three not that's three sections though. All the drink you can drink. Yeah. Four fifty. Four fifty. Okay. 
I'm telling you, time of our lives. Maybe it can make it happen. Who getting married next? Oh, never mind. I know the answer, but I won't say that out on here. Damn. But uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, man. We, we gotta, <laughs> that'll be a good time. It'll be a time of our lives, man. Okay. 450, though. It's 450. That's the number. Well, did you appreciate? I know it was for a special occasion. Did the person who trip it was, did they have a good time? Or we tried our hardest. It was really unorganized. You know? Okay. And then, okay. too, that was the issue where it was like. Sorry to hear that. But he people was organizing it though. People, but you're not supposed to be right, exactly. Mm-hmm. But yeah. then too, it's like it felt like a trip more than it was a bachelor party. Because mm, okay. you know, a bachelor thing, it need to be a concise focus on the yeah, person. Yeah, but we had people yeah. that was just out there doing, doing their own thing. thing. I like hate it was just a trip. Bro, I hate that. Well, and I like you. I like moving as a cohesive unit yeah. anyway. Same, same. You same. just got in to. general. Yeah, so you got same, to. same. The you fact to. that. It was like I say, and boys are just doing their own thing. It really just felt like we was on a trip with a bunch of dudes. Yeah, and oh. that's like my least favorite thing ever. I literally never want to go on a trip with a bunch of me and even like I'll do that with y'all because I like y'all, but I don't want to go on a trip with a bunch of men. Yeah, and then too is like you ain't gonna say, "Hey, we about to go here and we gonna figure it out when we get there." I would rather just send my money and not go. That really drives me crazy, bro. In the larger the group, I just can't do it. It's yeah, nah. I'm telling y'all, if y'all, and you know what I learned too. Even if you don't plan, you are gonna have to plan at some point. So if you don't do it ahead of time, right there, that's when. <laughs> well, what we about to do? Well, gotta yeah. take out Google, start searching, and it's like that. What I said in the last pod. If you would have did this, I before, say you man. never want to get to that point on a trip because it's gonna be that way. You are gonna have to figure out what to do regardless. Yeah. You might as well finish it, figure it out beforehand. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But you know, like I say, overall, it was it was alright. Mm, it was alright. I um my focus was wise man told me he said be the eye of the storm and I said that's what I'm gonna be this trip the eye of the storm the things we do like chaos happening around me people telling me they homeboy got locked up I said hey bro take that off speakerphone no mm-mm. we don't need so to you really it. you can hang up because if he yeah. there it's he, more than a week you can judge ain't coming back till Tuesday boss yeah. so. Memorial Week. I was like, hey, you the one who didn't want to give him your name. Yeah. <sighs> there we go. So, hey. And one, we don't Wait, even they know were, he was, They was with y'all? He was a plus one. We don't know him. You can bring a plus one to a plus one. a friend of a You friend. know what? You, I was going to say, there's, you there's already what? enough me in hey, And you know what? That's why I didn't go. Because I, I got invited. But I got invited. But see, but you got invited by. I got invited by the guy. Y'all about to say, no, that's yeah. different. He, yeah, this nah, dude just bought his home. But I, he still, you got invited and you told me, all right, pull up, bro. I know, I know. Yeah, it's like, completely different. I know. But I, you didn't miss nothing. You saved some money. Okay, because I, I definitely feel bad about Because I got you invited. Saved money. Yeah. Okay, okay. And you saved money. <laughs> and just time. Okay, you know. okay. I just want to go to the wedding. I got a few fits I need to get off. Yeah, for sure. Well, how was your? How was your? What? Eight, are you done? I don't know. I was going to get another life date update, but you no, know, no, no, cool. no, 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 no. You've been ahead. chilling, just working, busy season. What has yeah. been going on with you? Nothing worth talking about. All just right. taking some time to myself. I guess if that's news, trying to figure life out, and what could really be for me. Okay. 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 That's okay. it. Nothing too exciting. You know, the summertime, man, just trying to work through it. Mm-hmm. I keep forgetting it's the beginning of June. It's literally the second day. <laughs> Bro, I was, told y'all, I'm like that was crazy. The, it's the second in day in my world. It's like the twelfth, thirteenth. Yeah, you got you got a rough. But brother. in reality, no, it's not bad though. Mm-hmm. I like the busy season, man. It give you, keep you active. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's like I said, it's when Put I your head down. I, I accumulate all my time to take off the rest of the year when I want. Yeah. That's why I say if my job was like this year round, I don't know. Heck no. But the fact that I work hard three months out of the year, it's not that big yeah. of a deal. And now I'm only on, I'm on my second month now. So, yeah. Okay. And June going to go by fast because there's a lot of stuff I got planned. The wedding next week, mm-hmm. the week after our brotherhood trip. Yeah. And then, heck, June over with after that for the most part. Yeah. yeah. Then July. Man, the fourth is on a gross day. It's on mm-hmm. a Tuesday. So we get Tuesday off, but it's so like, it's, it restricts you because it's like, you can't like, I wish they gave us that Monday off mm. and we just worked the fourth because mm-hmm. it's like. So you got to work Monday, be off Tuesday, Tuesday work, come oh, back Wednesday. Wild. And it's so because it's going to restrict. It's like, well, you can't really go anywhere because yeah. you got to go to work Monday. And you then it's like, yeah, you can't do got to be right back Wednesday. 
even when you coming off that weekend, yeah. it's like I'm. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's like okay, it's yeah. like okay. Let me go back to work one day to be a for one day to go back to work. Yeah, that's wild. Sweet. But I think it worked out last year. If I'm doing my math right, we just got an extended weekend because mm-hmm. it only move a day unless it's a. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so got to enjoy it last year. But hey, man, we get Juneteenth off. And that go into an extended This is the first year they do that? Mm-mm. We got it off last year. Oh, okay. That's when it started getting recognized as a national holiday. Yeah. Mm. So that would be cool. I think I think I'm really looking forward to the, the little I it really hit me when I had when they when the la I had to pay the last installment. Half of it. Uh I think that was today. And I was like, Oh, this real. Got the address. Can't check in before four Friday. Okay. Which so basketball course this is gonna be a good time. Yeah, man. I'm looking good forward time. to that, yeah, man. Yeah. And I, good time. I know Friday I can't get out. I'm not gonna make it to about eleven, but PM. Yeah, yeah. but it'll be a win for me because I just missed all of Friday last time. Yeah, you did. Yeah. And I felt like everybody was kind of like they had really went for it Friday and yeah, yeah. Saturday was kind of. Yeah. See, that always be my fear with trips. Like I don't want to go co- so crazy the first day. Yeah, that like I'm in shambles and can't really drink and yeah, like, yeah, that's, that's yeah, me. Yeah. That was me. Yeah, that's Saturday. That was, always be my fear. I was out of there Saturday. Yeah, you was. Yeah. Everybody was kind of like you could just tell it was a long night the night before. Yeah, I was powering through. I be powering. I was about yeah. to say them boys. They they woke up way earlier than I did too, and they started early. Yeah, so that, be, that'd be my thing, man. I uh, that'd be my fear. It's like I want to enjoy myself, but. Yeah, I don't want to just crash out too early. Now yeah. on the last day, mm-hmm. you can or the, the middle day. Yeah, because we're out there Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So it's like, yeah, I think I'm a. I don't want to go Sunday because then I'm gonna spend my whole Monday just hung, you know, just hung over. So yeah. I think yeah. my day gonna be Saturday. Okay, but so I'm like, a, I ain't gonna. I'm not gonna run from Friday either though. I, I think I'm gonna just go for it to be honest. To be well, honest. I'm Friday, just hydrate and go say, for I'm it. I'm about to say yeah, I'm just gonna take a BC, bro. I ain't gonna just, lie. <laughs> and do my thing, bro. Yeah, I go say drink I'm a whole t- bunch I'm of water. I'm gonna try to work out on Saturday morning too, so that should get me right. I'm gonna just go out Find there and somewhere. get some shots up. I'm oh in, in the yeah. Oh, you about so, real, okay? Shot, shot. Yeah, shot, nah, I'm yeah. gonna just go out there and get three hundred mm-hmm. up. Well, you know, I'm a, I'm gonna be up for sure. I'm gonna be up. I'm gonna be up. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna get up early for sure. Well, you know, we, like I said, I'm just excited to be able to be there the whole time. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, so. yeah, that's good. And you ain't leaving until Monday, right? Yeah, yeah. Same. Okay, so, yeah. Oh, well, you yeah, that's that's good. that's that's good. Uh, that's, yeah. that's it seems like we you gonna be there for the long haul. Yeah, because I'm definitely getting there Friday sometime. I might, you know, me, I yeah. I go meal around and I'm a, do some other stuff, and then you know, I'm still trying to figure out if I'm gonna get off of work early on Saturday on Friday. Let me block but myself. I'm gonna drive to Austin, drop the family off in Austin, and then drive to mm. San Antonio. So yeah. we gonna, oh, see, that's that's a, that's great. That's yeah, great. That's great. so I'm gonna have like a little stop in between. So I'm gonna get there after four for sure. But I think I'll probably get there around like eight. I'm a, I'm gonna I'm 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 be the one at the door at four o'clock. I'm yeah. not gonna lie. Go ahead and get everything. Because you know, but to, but to be honest, I'm a good person to be there. Yeah, yeah. right there. Because yeah. I, I, you know, I me, mean, I go check the lights and yeah, I read sure. the get rules. The layer, the layer. Yeah, like okay, so this is in there. Cause, yeah, because by the time y'all came last time, I had to, I had the little fishing pole. Like, remember, yeah. I was like they got the fishing poles in it. You know, yeah. So, you yeah know. I'm about to say about the time I got there last time, y'all. Heck, people was on their midday nap when I got there. Yeah, because yeah. I had make it, I didn't make it till Saturday. I had to go to work that Saturday too. Yeah, I so you didn't make it until dang near three, four o'clock. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 it was late. But you know what? I I will be doing a poll. You know, um, to for the listeners, you know, um, I do want to ask what y'all want to eat because I want to cook Friday. I do like cooking. Yeah, I like cooking for people. So mm-hmm. y'all tell me what y'all want. I'm gonna cook it. I'm gonna make sure I get this stuff because. I told you about. I know he wants that spaghetti, but like I don't think I can recreate that. That was, I know everybody be talking about that spaghetti, but I that's like a yeah. That's just you just yeah. had to be there. Type but man. I just, but I just had it working. I, I might say that was yeah. a meatless spaghetti, but, and it was fire. It was fire, and it was fire. But Ed did With like salmon that. and eggs. But, on but side. Ed did like that steak I did the last Brotherhood trip. It was like, oh, I could tell you marinated this thing. Why? Wow, like, that was good. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. yeah, so I might do some, you know. It's crazy, though. Know, it's yeah. crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. But, um, no, um, you finished your recap? Everything good? 
You been good last week? Oh, uh, yeah. We ended up going home. Same no, as I, you, pretty much. I did much. the same yeah, thing. Yeah, but I did def I definitely did different than what you did. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Y'all, yeah. y'all went turned up. Yeah, I, yeah, we did. Whenever I go home, I don't even let people know I'm going home. I about to say I told uh, Corey. I was like, I said, boo, that I ain't even hear from him. You know yeah. what I'm saying? We was down there. Yeah. I don't even. I be chilling at the crib. But that's, man, that's what you man. should do when you're at yeah, home. Yeah, man. I but people back homes be different. Like my back mm-hmm. home be different than most people's. So. Yeah, you your back home is like big family. My yeah, back home is, is my daddy and them. Like yeah. that's, <laughs> that's, 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 that's yeah, you get out, out and about. You, you know, you know when you be at yeah in the city. Yeah. yeah, and you know what's so funny? There's a downside to that because the people I be like talking to, yeah, like women and stuff, and I tell them I'm going home. I be mm-hmm. having to tell them like, hey, you know, like this not gonna be a high community weekend for me. Yeah. Like, but I, I got to get that warning. Yeah. I'm like, oh, because when I'm back home. So like, you don't get that backlash. and Yeah. <laughs> I still get it, but. <laughs> yeah. They just know it's coming, huh? Yeah. Hey. You, they, they just get to warn somebody. Boy, yeah. good. They ain't going to make them accept it and yeah. like it. Yeah, but no, they no. like, well, at least they, he told they me. They don't like it. But they be saying stuff like, if you know you're busy, why you don't just. Yeah. Okay, but I. Okay. Yeah. This ain't that episode. But anyway. Yeah, 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 this yeah, ain't yeah, that yeah, episode. Yeah, yeah, but. Yeah. I be able to tell them like you know I'm back home like you know, cause I I literally text somebody that uh, that Friday I was like hey when I'm when I'm home I'm busy like I'm a busy person when I'm yeah. home I be picking people up dropping yeah. people off got this thing to get prepared for got to run to the store three yeah. four times and yeah you know yeah so, so, that's so. different than me I that's I go home I just set up a workout session for there that next go. morning there you go I go work out this time I went home. I went worked out after the workout. I came home and like cut my dad grass. There you go. Yeah, that's. Like, I used to be for a while. It was like when I go home, I'm not actually at my parent. I'm like out and about. Yeah, and, and at first and that's how I was. Yeah. yeah. Now I'm like you, where when I go home, I literally probably just be at my parents' house, yeah. like yeah. just chilling. Like I'm like, yeah, because time move so slow there for me. Yeah, since because I don't be doing anything, yeah. so right. it'd be. 10 feeling like it's like one o'clock in the yeah, morning to me yeah. and then i'm in bed by 10 yeah. 30 uh, yeah. but i like like because i like i go there and i just sit in the living room and all the action happened through the living room i can see people yeah. talk to people and stuff like that so but that's I, good for me because i'm like i'm like soaking it all in so i'm getting the most out of this like i guess quote unquote family time yeah i'm about to say because yeah. when i used to go home it really wasn't about family time nah, it was really just was, being back i was and, in them streets talk, bro. yeah I was in them streets, but bro. now when I go home, it really be like yeah. I just want to be around like my family because I mean our friends we kind of see them regularly, yeah. Anyway, we talk so regularly, yeah, yeah. So I don't yeah. be like as pressed to see them compared to just yeah hang out with my family, get that family time because yeah. Um, yeah don't get to get that as much out here. So yeah, that's that's really all it is. For I'm me. still go out once, but it's probably just gonna be once typically. Yeah, you better than me. I don't even. I told. They start asking questions. Hey, don't don't expect me to answer these, man. Don't don't worry about me. I ain't going there. I'm I'm a, I'm gonna be at home. Yeah, yeah. If y'all want to meet me somewhere, that's cool. But I ain't going out. I ain't trying to get dressed up. I ain't trying to impress nobody. None of that. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, I did that, man. And we dropped a little one off. He ain't even cry. How he didn't? <laughs> he ready? Hmm. Nah, I bro. thought he'd at least cry. Nah, man, he. I think he got kind of sad when he like realized what was going on mm-hmm. when they was like walking him back into the house. He was like kind of looking around and stuff. But by the time we like pulled off, he was like playing with the little kids that was in there and stuff like that. So mm-hmm. I was like, okay, well he gonna be good, you know, for the week or whatever. Um, we yeah, got. I, yeah, I was calling him every day. Nah, nah, my my parents ain't like that, bro. They like they told us beforehand, hey, don't call us because yeah, we ain't gonna I answer. Would have been the same. I would yeah. have said the same. But I'm you still, get one check in. Yeah, I'm. I was about to say I'm the type of person that like I don't need to call every day. Send me some pictures. Let me know that he all right, and then I'm good. Like, yeah. this, if this is my time away, this is my time away. I love him to death. That don't take away the love that I got for him. But mm-hmm. I don't need to call in and check up on him every five minutes, trying to see what he's doing, doing this and doing that. Like, mm-hmm. she called us the day. After we got back and was like, well, yeah, he was feeling under the weather, but, you know, he doing a little bit better. And I was like, okay, okay. She explained everything. After that, I was like, that's fine. Like, you done raised six of them. Yeah. 
I, I mean, hey, and I'm, I know, and I'm one of them. Concept. I was about to say, yeah, and, I, and I'm one of them, so I, I'm good. Like, I ain't, I ain't gotta, I ain't gotta ask no questions or nothing. Like, and I know that if anything wrong, she gonna call, but she yeah. sends some pictures. Oh, we just went to the park, or he sleep right now, or this and that, this and that. But other than that, I really do not. Yeah, that's all I like is little pictures. I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, and I say some, you know, I like the picture. I will say some, oh, he's so cute right now, this mm-hmm. and that, this and that, or she. Bought him something, you know what I'm saying? Or like whenever, whenever I was there with him, he wasn't messing with my daddy the whole time. Dang. Yeah. So I w- I started feeling bad because I was like, bro, this is who you gonna be here with. So you yeah. might want to get a little bit, you know. Yeah. But as soon as I left, she sent me a picture. Him and my daddy was sleep. He sleep on my daddy's chest. There you go. I was like, okay. There you go. Okay. There you go. Okay, that's cool. I, hey, I'm I'm cool with that. Okay. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. I'm comfortable with that now. But I like yeah. that. I like that. Yeah, man. But you know, we got back, and this week has been like jumbled up and i think it's because we was off monday yeah Mm -hmm. so like my week kind of been going by like super fast and i haven't been able to like kind of catch my footing and we going out of town this weekend too same Mm -hmm. yeah so i just been like work been kind of like irritating but i know it's because i can't really just like focus on it you know what i'm saying i feel like like those days are in the way yeah man like i just i can't really Mm -hmm. get productive so instead of being like Instead of being proactive, I'm being reactive. So it's mm-hmm. like if something come to me, that's what I work on instead of like me going do it, going do it, yeah. or like having my list. Like typically, like I make a list the night before on what I'm gonna work on the next day. And so this week I ain't been able to do that. I just been like, man, whatever they send me, that's what I'm gonna work yeah, on. If they don't send me nothing, I'm just I'm that, chilling. That's like, how my work is now. I can only be reactive because yeah. I'm waiting on people to give me stuff to work it, so I can only yeah. work with what's given to me. And right. then it's like once I'm working something, it's like. Yeah, if you don't see me got, or, yeah. or tell me I that it's know. something, I'm just working on what I got yeah. and moving on to the oh, next. Yeah, yeah. what's well, it funny me? Yeah, yeah. That's, very reactive right yeah. now. Yeah, and I I don't really like working like that. Like I said, I'm just I'm a real like just structural like I like to plan my days out, know what I'm mm-hmm. gonna work on, and then once I work on all of that, if I got time. Then I'll work on other stuff. You know what I'm saying? But right, 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 right. it was only a four day work week, but it felt like man. I'm me. talking about when whenever you were saying I you saw a, you said I didn't have an off day. Man, it didn't it feel just, like it. It felt so weird, man. It felt so weird, especially so. since I got to go back tomorrow. So it's kind of like oh no, it's a five day work I week for you. Five days anyway. Yeah. I had man. Mm-hmm. No, nah, that was no, it, man. I, I like, just it's feel just been, you. I just feel you. I just been preparing for this weekend. Like I said, I was telling you the other. I mean earlier. Like for the next three to four weeks, I'm just yeah, kind traveling of on the weekend. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just like all the way up until the trip. It's kind of back to back. Oh, yeah, because you say you got something. You said family reunion. Family reunion. Next reunion. I got Louisiana. A, I got a baby shower this weekend, a family reunion next weekend. Where is the that? brotherhood trip? The family what? reunion. Natchitoches. Uh, Nac- 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 Nacadish. Yeah. Nacadish. It's in Nacadish. So. Oh. That's was that that conversation we had on here? Yeah, on air. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I, was, I felt like I just had a recent deep dive about that. Yeah, yeah. with the brothers yeah. and with the yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Um, but yeah, that's that's next weekend. So I'm yeah, I'm just traveling, just all over, putting a lot of miles on the car. Mm-hmm. That's on my mind. This ticket is on my mind because I got to get that done <laughs> tonight. I, I need to pay. I need to do my defensive trying. Yeah, to find the paper then do it. Yeah, so <laughs> it's just. <laughs> It's a lot, man. It's a lot. So I've just been trying to like find my little spaces where I can find peace. You know what I'm saying? My nutrition ain't really been right. I've been drinking a lot of water, but I ain't been eating a lot. Yeah. I still been working out. Yeah. But I can feel it like when I'm working out, like, dang, I kind of need to eat something. Yeah. So, yeah. I actually been consistently, well, since I can't run right now, I've been consistently on my weight to again. Yeah. How you angle feeling, man? That's, That's what I'm supposed to do. going down, but I ain't, I'm not doing what I'm supposed to do on my end with icing. Yeah. Mm. So, mm-hmm. yeah. I can only hope for so much. But I'm about to. I was almost said, don't play on. with it, man. Yeah. I'm, I, don't play I, I with just, it. Don't play with it. I was about to do the same thing. <laughs> I'm just, I don't know. I just be moving around and then. Yeah. So I just be mm-hmm. getting and then. Like I said, when it, then I was in Vegas, I didn't think. Ice my ankle. That's a lot of water. Oh, well, yeah, you is, I freaking that, yeah. love when I'm on late in that time zone because I wake up yeah. like we Friday. I got back, probably put my head on a pillow at around four. I was up at seven thirty. Yeah, because you know they two hours behind, so I just yeah. always wake up early. Then the the next night when we didn't even go out, well, I didn't go out because the, they didn't know what they was gonna do and they was just going loiter. And I said, hit yeah. me up when y'all get somewhere. Yeah. 
Next thing I know, they was coming back into the room at yeah. 10 or something. So I went to sleep. Yeah. Ooh. Said, hey, out of storm. I yeah. Went to sleep. Was up at 530. Didn't go back to sleep. Was just up. Yeah. Ooh. That'll do it. Just up. That's when I go well, take that mom. I was walk. like, the wild thing is, it's like, if I would have went out. No, I didn't want to go out because yeah. I would have ran into a bunch of drunk people just Leaving, yeah, just leaving the club, yeah, and, yeah, like and I was like, and, yeah, I was like, bro, yeah, we yeah, on yeah. different types of times. Yeah. Now, if, I, my, if my leg was good, I probably would have went for a little run, yeah. which probably would have been annoying too, because it's, yeah. it's a strip, a lot of people. Yeah, I can't stand those people. Like when you run in crowded areas, yeah, like you know, this about to be crowded. Why like you, if somebody go for a run on bourbon at night, like yeah. come on, bro, like yeah, yeah, yeah. you yeah. making your life hard. You you kind of just impose in, in, impose me your wheel. Yeah, like yeah. You somebody running on Sixth Street at ten o'clock. Yeah. Come on, yeah, bro. Come on, bro. Chill out, bro. Yeah, I would have been on. that guy. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, okay. But nah, I, I did like that though. That I'm gonna always wake up because I wake up early anyway. But I get it's, it's almost like, like I get a two early. hour grace period. Yeah, yeah so that's kind of so when I was living on the on the west. Yeah, I loved that too. Like the days seem longer out there for me. Yeah. Because like I'm my my body is so used to being central. Yeah. yeah so 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 I'm just two hours ahead of everything. Yeah. So what you talking about? I definitely feel you and like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like yeah. it ain't never felt too early to me or something like yeah. that. Like where well, yeah. I've been up, I've been like, well, I've been up. You know. Yeah. So so but anyways, uh, but no man. Um, how was your trip to Orange Bud? Oh yeah. yeah, my trip. We had to- two totally different experiences. Man, man. Well, my trip was good. Um, so I went down back home for my little cousin graduation. So um, it was cool. You know, she graduated from my our, our alma mater. Yeah, you know, so I ain't gonna put the name out there, but uh, you know, it was nice, and you know, it's all built up over there now. I went to see it. Yeah, they got yeah. The, they got the new building and Completely stuff. Completely jealous, man. Bro. I was jealous. Jealous. I said if they had this because you know that's like the, that's like the yeah. gym now. Like yeah. where they play the basketball game, they had the carpet out there. Yeah. But mm-hmm. I was like, man, we had but this. They had like the jumbo trunk. Yeah, I said time. that. I said, hey, we had this. I would have kept hooping. Yeah. I literally would have kept. I would have tried harder. How about <laughs> <laughs> I definitely, I tried I definitely kept. I would have kept hooping, but it was nice and it was laid out. Um, so do they still got the old gym? Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. Oh, so I guess that's the practice. Yeah, because yeah. the yeah. back gym is the weight room now. Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. The back I see gym. What they yeah. Did. So they like, no but time. they had even like fixed up our old, like the gym. Like where we used to have games. They yeah, fixed yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. That didn't look the same. Yeah, yeah. When that's I saw nice. a picture, I was like, wait, yeah. that don't even look the yeah. same. That's nice too. That's yeah, nice. It'd be too. ironic if they did nothing to the classrooms, but they just got new. I don't think they did. They didn't do facilities. anything to the them classrooms. Always, them bro. hallways still the they same. They still the same with that that blue and light blue and the, 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 jelly bean, jelly bean, new, the jelly bean. new yeah. football yeah. field track, yeah. everything basketball. but the hallway. And they doing the the press box new. Yeah, they yeah. building that up right All now. All new yeah. sporting facilities, yeah. classrooms still look the yeah. same. Yeah. But that that tell you everything that they needed to know about our yeah, bye, bye, yeah, bye, yeah, bye, yeah. yeah. That's funny. And it was funny because I, you know, I seen, you know, I seen some of our people we went to school with in there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and they's like, dang, you see what they got now? I was like, I know. I was like. It was our parking lot. You yeah, know? literally. <laughs> like, where they gonna park at now? Yeah, I was like, Bro, is- the bus barn is behind the field. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, is. yeah. it is. I ain't seen. I, bro, I was like, dang. I, I, I feel. I still know what old people mean now when they go back in the main. Man, this used to be this. Yeah, yeah. And this actually used to be what we parked. Yeah. It was just a big parking lot. Yeah. We didn't yeah. use it all. And they probably like, yeah. man, how, how how could this be the parking lot? I'm like, bro, this was a big parking lot. Yeah. Like this middle was not here. Was, I dug yeah. you right there. Or like the old middle I school. Dug you right I dug you right there. Or like the old middle school. Like, nah, these was too big. Buildings. This yeah, wasn't it, and it was a, a lot street of people down the middle. Like, yeah. There was a street down. Like there was, a, we had to block off the street. Yeah, so yeah. people wouldn't turn down. Yeah, man. But um, anyway, oh, man. it was a good family oriented weekend. Um, most time I do go home. It's family, you know, stuff. And you know, I'm big on family. Uh, you know, some people might think it's like minuscule. You know, it was like my little cousin, but it was like Charles and Jason. But so this was like the first great. There's a second Buddha gonna Buddha gonna <laughs> well, I know Buddha. This is the second great yeah. grandchild, but she was like the first girl. Yeah. Well this was like the child that was born like when Jason and them stayed like across the hall from me yeah. in Ridgemont. Mm-hmm. So yeah. she's been like my little girl. She was yeah. like my niece before my niece, yeah. to be mm-hmm. honest with y'all. Yeah. Like before uh, Justin had my nieces. So yeah. she was like the niece before the niece. So we really, you know, we really yeah, like tied close, it. Yeah. Really close. So I went out there, and it was just cool. You know, graduations are like 
graduation. Right. You know, celebratory. Yeah. Celebratory. Yeah. Celebratory. And like, we had a little moment after that, um, back at the house. At, that wasn't the graduation party. That's this weekend. But yeah. Um, we had a little moment. I was kind of putting on game about, I said, man, you know, real life start now. Like, yeah. I make them real life decisions, you know what I'm saying? And she told me what she's going to college, and I'm like, okay, you want to pay attention over there. Yeah. TSU. Yeah. You have to pay attention over there. I was like, that's yeah. dangerous. Ooh. I saw, I, yeah. saw, I, saw, I said, that's a dangerous place. Yeah. Not because, I mean, it's dangerous. She it's dangerous. Full year, but she it's graduate. Dangerous. It's dangerous. Yeah, nah, for real. It's dangerous, but I told her, like, it's so, because, like, that's, like, built into the city. Yeah. yeah. Like, UNT is UNT. Yeah. Mm-hmm. When you at UNT, you at UNT. Yeah. And if you just go mess off and then you just looking for that. Yeah. yeah. It ain't just like... Yeah. It ain't like Lamar and TSU where like just regular people just walking through the... I was camp. about to say, yeah, TSU is just... That's just it's a, in the middle of third war. Yeah, I was about to say, that's, like, a, that's, that, that, that's just part of the hood at yeah. that point. Yeah. So I, I was giving her a game about that, but um, outside of that... Um, it was cool. So uh, it was Sheldon's uh, birthday. Happy birthday to Sheldon. Yeah, Lee. Yeah. So it did kind of coincide. It did kind of coincide. So yeah. it was Lee's birthday. Um, you know, it was like <laughs> it's funny. I was doing things for my cousin during the day, but I was doing things for Lee at night. night. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like during the day, I was at her stuff. You know, yeah. messing with her. I dropped her off at a party. Yeah. <laughs> like a high school party, hmm. and I was like, "Dang!" Was it at the house? No, it was at the it was at the hotel. It was huh. at the hotel. Oh my! Well, we called it the Vermada, but yeah, now it's, it's called something else. Oh, okay. Yeah. It was at Vermada, and I dropped her off. Yeah. And I was just like, Yeah. I was like, whoa, this was us. Yeah. You know, this was, well, we was in the Avalon. But I was about to say, yeah. You saw, you saw kids walking up. Hey, fresh white tee. Mm. White tee, jeans, mm-hmm. some little shoes. Yeah. I was like, man, that was used to be me, man. Yeah. <laughs> but now they drinking like some vodka and Hennessy. Yeah. They part. I was like, but we had that, mm. you know. Everclear. Yeah. Pinnacle. Pinnacle. Oh, my God. I was telling them on the vibe. I was like, but we had that pinnacle. Like, the kind of king. At least y'all boy advanced. Like, like the advanced stuff is more normal to y'all now. Yeah. Like. Back then, Savak was like a. Oh, that was a luxury. Yeah. I didn't even think. Yeah, that was like somebody. That, yeah. yeah, like that. that that's somebody older was. had it. Yeah. Maybe and you and tried to They might have stolen it. They might have stolen out the camp. You know, you saw somebody with Savak in the party back in that day. You like what? You yeah, know, what was, what I'm how you got that? How you I was got like, that? I was yeah. like, I was like, I'm 1942. Yeah, that was. That was like rare. Hennessy, I never even thought about Hennessy. I ain't know. I ain't really know about Hennessy until we graduated. Yeah, so I was in college, like. Yeah. I don't think I even had Hennessy till we was like yeah. in college. But uh it was cool, but um shout out to Sheldon. We went out Saturday. Um it was a good little time, you know, it was all the people y'all know. Um couple of Beaumont people. It was cool. Then Sunday we did a little Sunday brunch at uh Paul Nine. Um it was cool. Yeah, you know what? You actually could have came. Cause it wasn't even deep like that. It wasn't deep like that. Yeah. Like, we was having conversations. Like, we was able to have conversations with people. Yeah. Um, I guess it wasn't one of them weekends that a promoter was there. Yeah. You know what I mean? But it was still nice, though. Yeah. It ended up getting packed at the end, but we was leaving after that. We was there for a long yeah. time. I didn't even, I ain't even, like, prepared to go out. Because I was supposed to leave on Sunday. I thought you would. Yeah, that's why I was, was supposed to leave on Sunday. That's why so Monday I didn't when you said you got back, I was like, damn. I yeah, too, because, yeah, yeah, I thought so, I thought too. Because you, you, you said you was going to be chilling at home all day. That's when you said that. You had just made it. I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, I was yeah. supposed to I was supposed to go home on Sunday, but uh, we ended up going fishing Sunday morning instead oh, of Saturday morning. So I was like, okay, I'm going to stay an extra day like just to fish? go to fish. I like the feeling of it, man. I like to just go like, out there. And, yeah, I like being in You know what I'm saying? Just... I like to be in nature, and it's just it's soothing, bro. Do you take your fish off the hook? Huh? Do you take your fish off the hook? That's the thing. Oh, do I take my fish off? Yeah. Yeah. Because some people don't take their fish off the hook. I know we looking crazy because we do that. What else could you do? Some people get other people taking it. They don't like to touch it and touch uh, it. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, no. Nah. I mean, I, I, that's what I said. We if don't believe teeth, it. I'm, See, I'm, I'm, just, just, I'm like the type of person that'll go fishing that don't, that don't want to fish. I just like being out on water. Oh, yeah. serene. You just sit there. Yeah. I literally get nothing out of fishing. I, I'm the type. I go... I go pee. fish. I, I, just don't expect, like the I don't expect to, to catch nothing. Especially yeah. with people. I'm really just going. It's just a calm environment to socialize. Yeah. 
Well, see, I don't want to. I don't want a piece. I don't, don't want a piece of blueberry. I ain't gonna be calm there. But, uh, no, I, 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 I got a I got a fish somewhere. I got a fish Jasper. Yeah, I got a fish Jasper. I gotta go up that road. I gotta go up that road. Yeah, I need. I need. I need to go about an hour, hour and a half away. But yeah, but yeah, that's 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 what it is for me, man. I just like to go out there. I I don't expect to catch nothing. I literally just like to go. I know I ain't gonna catch nothing. I'm just gonna throw it out there. Mm-hmm. Eat me some sunflower seeds And it's crazy So I guess I would uh, Describe my weekend And just like If I had to put a word on it It was like chapters man mm-hmm. I saw my little cousin Closing the chapter mm-hmm. uh, And I saw my brother You know Open his brother Man like he Already at his You know like yeah. And I was like Well you know last Well actually Earlton This is our graduation date Like uh, 11 years ago June 2nd Yeah June yeah. 2nd That's when we graduated I got the memory Thank y'all got good memory Yeah Yeah, yeah. But anyways um, It was just funny seeing that Yeah Seeing somebody transition To an adulthood And seeing somebody That's like Knee deep We now we in it now Yeah like, And I was just like Just like speculating On the differences of that You know yeah. And how like It's so brand new to somebody Yeah And then it's already Routine to somebody else. I was about to say Life Everything in life is happening simultaneously. Yeah, like, like the same oh yeah, time. like somebody yeah. graduating, somebody yeah. turning thirty, somebody. Yeah, and you know what's funny? Yeah. You know what's funny? I dropped off to that party. I picked her up. Yeah, and I was like, man, she fucking like, man, that's one loud as far as I went to. Yeah. It's like, dang, like she don't even know she about to go through all this other she stuff. She about to go to college. Yeah, yeah. I'm about to say, I was like, man. And stomp a hole through the floor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but no, it was a yeah. good weekend. I got to, you know, uh, just touch base with fam and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, you know, I guess, I mean, I, I, I know we pretty deep. I know our topic was lifelong lessons. Like, yeah. And it kind of like made me think about this and I asked y'all this. What was, what was a lesson that y'all, that y'all, Learned or began to learn in adolescence, high school, that you probably ain't get the clarification for that until later on. Like, okay, this is what I was really learning at that time. I know it's confusing. I know it's confusing. I, think I, understand, I understand what you're saying. Question. I'm I just don't. trying to think about like, it. Like, 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 like you started learning it then, but maybe you ain't you ain't realize you ain't you, apply it. You ain't realize that you grafted into like later on, like, mm. like something you thought you knew. Because I mean. Y'all was pretty conceited guys. I about to say, I thought I, I knew y'all, everything. I, 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 say, I, I thought th- I knew everything. Yeah. But because that's when you said that, I, I think one of the main things I just learned was humility. Mm. That was like one of my first lessons I learned as an adult. Because you didn't like have I'm that talking about like eighteen, like you know when I okay. finally went off to school. Okay, it was okay. humility. Okay. Because like I said, I was just so used to everything just going in my favor. I was to say, what was your humility like? You're not as good as you think you are, or you're not as just you. Yeah, just you're man. just another human. I know. Okay, go ahead. Just go ahead. I'm gonna say just say mine, right? just just multifaceted. Just like I said, I just thought mm-hmm. like I, I had just went out. on the type of run where it's like I thought I knew everything, anything I wanted, or yeah. somebody I wanted was interested. Like it just all worked out for me. So like. Mm. Mm. Yeah, just when like mm. it just all stopped working for me, like it yeah. was just like, oh no, the like, way you go, like you started yeah. over, yeah, yeah. 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 It was like because yeah. it was like, yeah. I guess I didn't realize that it was like it took twelve years to build to this one year of of an amazing just, run I yeah. had where it just all okay. worked in my favor finally, okay, okay. okay. Yeah. and I think I was just like on the high, you know, like yeah. a peak, yeah. Then it was just a valley after that, and you was like, <laughs> and then it was like for me, it was just like everything I thought I knew and stuff. It was like I just had to relearn life, yeah, just conceptually from everything because it's like okay, you on your own now, like you don't do or you don't have to do everything you did, even like yeah. with my yeah. faith. Yeah. Uh, oh, come on, that was kind of one of them things where it was like it was just you know kind of mm-hmm, honestly mm-hmm. You just at some point. Just kind of go through the motions. Like, okay, well, I know I'm going to go to church. No, I'm going to Sunday yeah, school. Right, 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 right. But then it was like, when it hit me, it was like, oh, I don't got to do none of that. But it was like, mm. okay, so what is my relationship really like with God yeah. and stuff? And that's when I actually got closer to yeah. him. Like, And this is like when I need it the most. Yeah, I'm going to say, that was the irony. When I stopped going to, yourself, yeah, I'm gonna yeah. say, when I stopped going to you know, church and stuff yeah. every Sunday, that's when I actually felt like I actually grew more of a personable relationship with him. Cause it's really, yeah. it's really yeah. me and you. It, ain't yeah, like, it was just, it was, it was just me and him. And yeah. then too, it was yeah. just like, yep. like I said, it was just humility. Cause I was just so used to like always having people around me. 
It was like everything I thought I knew my life. It, everything was the opposite now. Like you just when I was in. just so used to always having at least one or two people around me. Now I'm just alone oh, with man. myself, yeah. with my own thoughts. Yeah. yeah, a lot of time to think. Yeah. And just like that's why I say it was just humility because it was just like yeah, everything you thought you knew you don't know. Yeah, you know, just go. Then you get exposed to so much stuff like because it was like. I didn't know like people parents actually be like doctors and lawyers. I thought that was some movie stuff. Right, right, like, right. Like we just like I say, just getting exposed to you know different walks of life because everybody yeah. didn't grow up like you, but you right. know in the small town, it's like it's only everybody, everybody doing the same thing. And it's really yeah. only like four say, jobs. It's, it's, and it's yeah. like a slight same variance thing in a different way. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna say and it's like a slight variance, but everybody pretty much experienced the same stuff when you're in the small town. So right. it's just like. That being it, and like I said, I think that was it for me, just humility and realizing, oh, like, you thought you knew everything, but that was in this little world, but and now this, welcome to in this the realm. world. In this realm, yeah, 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 now, yeah. Now you go into the world, world yeah. you don't know nothing. nothing. Yeah. And you just a small piece And it's like, you yeah. literally don't know nothing, because it's like, you in, even in a new environment, I don't know where that road go. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I, I literally only know my little yeah. small area that I mean. Like, I yeah. don't, you don't know nothing compared yeah. to Somewhere you've been for eighteen years of your yeah. life, where you know every you street, need, you don't need your phone to get to where you yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was just, I think, like I said, it was just humility and realizing that you don't know anything. Mm-hmm. That's yeah. what I learned in my early adolescence. Okay, yeah, mm-hmm. I would say. So that's a lifelong lesson you yeah. continue to learn, even as you grow. Oh yeah, I operate under the the the, mm-hmm. the, the uh, with that mindset. It was like mm-hmm. I don't. I, I ain't above learning. Like yeah. I don't know everything. Yeah, I don't yeah. pretend to. Yeah. I don't. Yeah, I'm happy. Like, I'm about, always open to learn something. I'm Even happy. something I think I might know. It's always something new yeah. to learn about yeah. it. Yeah, I think that. Uh, I wouldn't say humility, but I would say that what I've learned was like around the same thing. So like, for me, I understood what you got. You got two ears and one mouth, mean. Okay, there we go. Mm. There we go. So, like, you always know that. Like, I ain't never been just the most talkative person in the world. Never. But I've I've definitely been a type of person that's like I kind of got off on being able to like answer questions or being the one that like people come to for answers type situation. <laughs> and uh, and I don't know why he laughed, but I laughed. <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't know why you laugh. I just laughed because yeah. he laughed. I'm sorry, but uh, I don't know what he talked about. Because I just thought about young girl too. Okay, he used to be yeah. wrong a lot, but he used to think he knew. Oh, I used to, I used to talk that. We talk. we used to have an hashtag. Yeah, bro, <laughs> he used yeah. to be wrong, but he said with the utmost confidence. Yeah. He didn't lack confidence. But oh, see, man. and that so that's that's kind of where like that's that's where I'm going with it. Is like Damn, I had man. I had so much confidence. Yeah, it was a lot of confidence for sure. Right until I like got on my own and realized that that confidence was fake. It was good for mm, where I was. That's good. Ooh, that's but it wasn't good for the world. You know what mm. I'm saying? Fake like, confidence. That's yeah. interesting. That's yeah, like interesting. you get. That's interesting. Yeah. Like you, that confidence wasn't built on a foundation. Ooh. You know mm. what I'm saying? So when you, you get fired, on, he fired now. You yeah, fired. So when you get on your own, like so when I got on my own, that's when I like <clears> learned. That my confidence wasn't like built on no foundation. It was it was built on, I was spewing out stuff that I had heard, or mm. you know, I was spewing out stuff that like mm. I had read maybe, but I hadn't like applied. So I had the right. knowledge, but I ain't had the wisdom. So that's where mm. I'm confident mm. in the knowledge, but I wasn't confident in the application of everything. So it's do like you mathematics, baby. Yeah. So it's like <laughs> do you mathematics? Yeah. Baby. So I ain't had an understanding. Yeah. Yeah. So I, <laughs> hey man. <laughs> <laughs> this is the second. No, you're mathematic. The twenty third. Come on, knowledge. Yeah, come on, yeah, man. Yeah, but uh, I know mine. Yeah, <laughs> I know mine. Yeah, but that uh, that like bad, that was. I'm sorry. But I mean, even even in that, like that's that's when I started learning. You know what I'm saying? Whenever I came across the knowledge, and so when I came a, when I that kind of like opened up a whole another world for me. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So whenever I got on my own, and uh, things started happening. And I started realizing, like, dang, I don't, I don't know what to do. Mm-hmm. First thing I did was start blaming everything, everything Out, outside of myself. Outside of it you, was, yeah, yeah. I didn't get taught enough. I didn't get this. You know what I'm saying? Or, Ooh, I've been, or I've I was, been I was told sure. the wrong thing. So I'm, I'm blaming, I'm blaming my dad. I'm blaming my mom. I'm blaming everybody. I'm just like, man, 
y'all ain't give me what I needed to get to this point. Mm -hmm. And so for me, that was like the big thing. So after I got through that phase is when I kind of like had to sit down with myself and be like, bro, you don't know nothing. Yeah. So you, 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 you don't know. Something. Yeah. That's like you, you like you don't know nothing. And, and that's like, that's the hardest part to <laughs> yeah. tell yourself. Like you don't know anything, but it's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's okay not to know. Just shut up. It's kind of like what Ed just said too. Yeah, yeah. Like it's just you don't know nothing, but it's okay to not know nothing. But you have to like tell yourself that like mm -hmm. one that you don't know, and two that it's okay not to know, mm -hmm. and three it's okay to go and find out, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and that mm -hmm. you ain't got to tell like you ain't got to be the one that everybody come to for that knowledge. Yeah, mm -hmm. like yeah. you don't have to. And that yeah. was that's what yeah. I like. That's what that confidence like came through. It came through other people. Yeah, saying, "Oh, he like he, you know, he he got it. You know what I'm saying? He's smart." Or if you need something, go talk to. It's just like at that point, it was kind of like, "Nah, I really, I really don't know." And that's when I started saying, "Like, all right, nah, I, I don't really know the answer to this question. I don't really know myself. I ain't really, I ain't really got it like y'all think I got it." You know what I'm saying? I had a lot of things materially that okay. I felt like was kind of giving me affirmation and validation and, and validation mm -hmm. to and, or giving my ego ego that's validation. what it is ego ego yeah. um mm -hmm. giving, giving you reason to believe so reason, reason to, to believe, believe it's like yeah. i got all of these things so i got to know something mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying like i, I gotta know something <laughs> you know what i'm saying i'm, I'm, pull, I'm pulling up and i got these i got two cars i got this i got that you know what i'm saying i'm about to do this i'm about to do that yeah and it's like after a while, all of that stuff that that you kind of hit that peak, <clears throat> mm -hmm. and then on the way down, it's like you you try to catch mm -hmm. on to stuff or hold on to stuff or, you know what I'm saying? You you trying to just you you basically trying to hold on to that foundation that ain't there, right, 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 mm -hmm. right. You know what I'm saying? It's made out of wood and it ain't made out of uh, cement. Cement. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? So it's like it just you start grasping that stuff, and so that's when I really learned like, all right, you kind of got to shut up. And really learn and mm -hmm. really apply. Yeah, so, you know what I'm saying. And, and if you don't know, say I don't know. And that realization just came from experience, right? It, it came from like experience. You, it ain't it like you graduated, from... then you instantly knew that. You know, what right? I'm saying? You nah. had to like go through stuff to like right give you that realization. Right. I graduated. You know, and we talked about this on on uh, one Co of the yeah, earlier parts yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. where I graduated. Everybody went off to college, or not everybody, but most of everybody no, yeah. went off to college. Yeah, we was gone, and so I like told myself that mm -hmm. I'm smart because I stayed at home and mm -hmm. I did what I did, mm -hmm. but I couldn't even like. I didn't even finish what I had set out to do. Right. Mm -hmm. So instead I said, okay, nah, I ain't, I'm not going to do that. Right. I'm going to do this. This is good. And this is why this is good. And this is why this is smart. Right. And instead of trying to figure that out, I said, I'm doing this. This is what it looked like to people. So this is what I'm going to portray. Mm -hmm. And when people start saying, oh man, you working at a bank. Oh bro, you like, Mm. You gotta be doing good. Like you mm -hmm. gotta be. Mm -hmm. Yes, I am. I am doing good actually, and I know all of these things about all of this stuff. And you know what I'm saying, like, mm -hmm. and and you 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 talk more than you listen, and that's what I was doing. It mm -hmm. was I was just talking more than I listen. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I just yeah yeah. That's just that's just really what it was. So after I moved and like really was on my own instead of still staying at home, because yeah. when you at home, you kind of still a kid. You know what I'm saying? Like you, 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 you grown, but you a grown yeah. kid. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. especially if you ain't really got to pay bills. Like talking about like, and I didn't. I was just able to co come and go as I please. That is a difference maker. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like that's, that's a difference maker. For that's sure. it. You know what I'm saying? I did. You know, if my pops asked me to do something. I did that or whatever. But mm -hmm. other than that, it's kind of like you know, it is what it is. So yeah. Yeah. it's just, I'm still a grown kid. So it it really ain't hit until mm -hmm. I actually move. So whereas y'all's was like y'all left and went to college and instantly got that and instantly got yeah, that punch yeah. in the face. It didn't hit me until yeah. like twenty two, twenty three. Mm. You know what I'm saying. So as mm. everybody going, they y'all y'all got past that part. You know what I'm about, saying. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm like I get out there. And I'm like man, I I got it made. I'm doing this and doing that. And then all of a sudden I'm like no, you I'm don't. down. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. Like I'm on my ass. So like yeah. 
that was that was something that like I realized that it was just like, man, it's okay to not know and it's okay to just listen. It's okay to not interrupt somebody, even if you think you already know something. Mm-hmm. They might say something that you might not even have mm-hmm. heard before. Mm-hmm. So even now, like if somebody telling me something and I know, like even at work, like if somebody telling me something and I feel like, oh, well, I know what you're talking about. Mm-hmm. I'm going to let you finish because it might be something at the end that I might be like, oh, I didn't think about that part, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let me apply that part, though. Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, sir. But for me, it used to be if if you start saying something and I already know, mm-hmm. I'm going to just say, oh, no, no, no. I know that. I know that. Okay, mm-hmm. I got it. I got it. Don't worry about it because I, I, I got that. I, I know that. Mm-hmm. And then I end up failing. Mm. And then be like, oh, well, why you ain't tell me? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That it was yeah. the extra part. And they'd be like, well, you know, I tried, but you said you already knew. So, mm-hmm. I just so you, yeah. yeah, so it was just it was just a lot of like having to learn that I couldn't point outward and say, point nah, inward. my problems was with y'all or out there. It was like, nah, you got to sit down and shut up and like actually learn. And actually apply so that you'll actually understand what's going on in the world. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. What about you, man? It's like it's funny because we kind of all got the same answer, right? <clears throat> but I, I I give mine in a different way. Um, I'll say this, and I'll be honest. My lifelong lesson was learning that, well, even as an adolescent, like I wasn't as good of a I wasn't as good of a man as I thought I was. Mm-hmm. Dang. Mm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now, when we was young, you know, you know, I was a positive dude. Y'all know me. I'm optimistic and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Uh, but that don't mean you don't got flaws. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, um, and I didn't have a God complex, but I thought I was on the right side of the fence most of the time mm-hmm. with, with a lot of things, you know? Yeah. I thought that I was a pretty good judgment of character. Mm-hmm. Intuition has been pretty good all my life. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, and I, and I had to learn that, like, my approach wasn't, isn't always the good approach. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I have one approach. Yeah. Mm-hmm. A mist of others. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, the way I go about it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I had to learn that, like, people not always going to feel that what you feel, Juke. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because, mm-hmm. you know, to be able to tell you, I well, we we and Ed don't have arguments, but if you like discuss, it's like, yeah. Well, Dan, why you didn't do this? Well, you should have said this like this, Ed. Well, Ed, you want to get the information. Yeah. I'm like, well, Ed, you ain't think about what that person. Yeah. You're like, fuck, they feel it. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It's been a couple of nights like that. It's been a couple. Of, it's been a, that part is high as it get. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'd be like, you know what I'm saying? I get home, so I'm just telling you, like, this is like college time when we going out yeah. and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. High school, it's like, uh, it's like whatever. Yeah, it like, is what it is. Because he might say that to somebody, like, yeah, he need to hear that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, but you know, after you know school and stuff like that, I start realizing, like, you know, everybody approach to life ain't your approach. You know, yeah. and if they don't have these qualities, that's okay. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and I have to like turn that mirror on myself and be like, okay, what are you doing? You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Like. How are you not approaching the situation? You know, yeah. like I used to like, um, you know, I used to like pride myself in things like making good decisions, like being a leader. You know, that was a big thing for me. Yeah, being a leader, like yeah, having an answer with somebody. You know, what I'm saying yeah. making informed decisions for yeah. like groups of people. Yeah, you know, what I'm saying I had to like detach myself from that because like a lot of times it was to my detriment. Yeah, mm-hmm. there's a lot of nights nice, I was at my house playing a game. I was. Sleepy as hell. Yeah, mm-hmm. but I'm like shit. I'm gonna sit here and yeah, and watch Ed and Coop play this third game in NCAA. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, in uh, I didn't have that voice. You know? Yeah, I was doing a good thing. I mean, I felt like they wanted to be there. Yeah, but I wasn't doing what was right for me. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And having those and, boundaries. Yeah, for real. And I put myself on the back burner a lot of years. You know. Yeah, within the friend group and just just in life in general, like well, let me take this hit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Where it's like, no, bro, you ain't got to do that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You ain't got to put yourself in a lesser position. Yeah. Because of people, yeah. you know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, yeah. and that was something that I really had to learn throughout the years because, like, I've done it a lot. You know, and I still find myself doing it sometimes. Like, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, it's it's mm-hmm. never ending. Like it's never. You always well, you know, yourself. like, well, you got to understand what your disposition is. Like, yeah. Some people just. General genuine disposition is to this, you know. Yeah. 
And sometimes you got to say that. Like, yeah. I bring something up to you, like, hey, j- hey, bro, like, I know your disposition is to approach it like this, yeah. but look at it like that, you know? Yeah. And that, like that, if that's my stuff, sometimes I got to hear that for somebody else. Like, Drew, I know you feel like these people going to care, but we got to say, bump that right now. We yeah. trying to do this, you know? Yeah. And I had to, I had a lot of people come in my life and teach me that. That's what I mean for like life lesson. Like it wasn't mm-hmm. just head. It was like being involved. Okay, first of all, you know, sports, of course, coming out of high school. But after mm-hmm. that, being in these groups and organizations in college, mm-hmm. uh, you know, exec boards. Yeah. And then after that, uh, AmeriCorps, going to California, yeah. leading a team of people that don't got no kind of background like yeah. me. Like So you get like, you get a lot of stuff that sharpens you. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And I had to accept the sharpening. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, yeah. Okay, they're telling me this is for a reason. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. They just saying yeah. it because they say it. Yeah. Um, and I just had to tell myself to just stay like adaptable and versatile like that mm-hmm. and realize like I ain't always got the right answer, like I said. Um, but just how you view yourself can be different. Like, I thought I had a grasp on a lot of things when I was in college. Yeah. I mean, in high school, it turns out I didn't. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. And I say this a lot of time, like, why I like y'all as friends, because I know discipline is not one of my strong suits. Yeah. Like, I've disciplined in a couple things, but, like, overall discipline, nah, I got to do things to keep myself disciplined. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, I got to put, there's got to be, like, weighted consequences for me to be disciplined. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I learned that about myself throughout adulthood. Because in, like, high school, okay, yeah. I'm going to go to block because that's just where we going. We yeah. going, we play football. Like, yeah. But it's once you get out of school and you ain't got, like, that, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, you start to figure out yourself that you fail on. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And uh, I had those realizations a lot. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, those are things I had to learn about myself. And I feel like I'm still working on those things, you know? Uh, you know, to make myself a good man or whatever, blah 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 blah. Uh, yeah. But no, I, I I just feel like those things shape you because I still, you know, you still got those core values. Like I know, oh, yeah. like I know who I am. Yeah. Right? yeah, but it's like these things. Like I, I gotta get better at these little yeah. attributes. It's like I know who I am, but I know I could be better. Be better, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's what it is. Be yeah. better, and um, I think that's what's been a, a good lifelong lesson for me. And just like maturity, I think reality of life. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's another life. Like, yeah, you ain't gonna never stop learning that. Just the reality of your life, you yeah. know. What I'm saying? Like, like the first time they turned my lights off, like, dang, yeah, you don't pay this bill, they are gonna turn your lights yeah. off. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, they, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, they don't play. They don't play. Yeah, they don't play. You can say, yeah. you know, you can say whatever you want to say, but if that's not that, yeah, then they turn this like, hey, and say like, well, you gotta go to work. Like, yeah. even if you don't want to, go do this. You but know, say, yeah. When you th- when you was talking about the reality of your life, I thought about myself that like it's yeah. really all on you. Yes, as an adult. Like, yes, yes, yes. It ain't and it ain't nobody, nobody coming to, to say. Put it, yeah, put it plainly. That's yes. what I'm saying. And nobody like, coming to say you, and even the people that care, it's like. It's a scale to that because it's like, okay, they care, but you still got to be the one to, yeah, yeah, to, to yeah. do the action. Yeah, yeah. that's what I was saying. Yeah. Like, I was at home. I was an adult, but I still, like, ain't. I didn't was have I to. Was I really? Yeah, I didn't <laughs> yeah. have to pay no bills. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But, that, well, that's why I felt that. Yeah, yeah but, you know, that. once I moved. And I think another thing was, like, like, I had to learn how to really take accountability. Mm-hmm. Like, I, I talk, thought. Talk about it. Bro, I thought. I used to think like accountability was just saying, "Oh my bad, bro." That was yeah. on, that was on me, like blaming yourself. You know what I'm saying? Oh, but shit. accountability is like saying that, okay, I messed up. That was on me. But mm-hmm. also like, I gotta change this and make sure that it don't happen again. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But me, I was yeah. just like, Correction. as long as yeah, as long as I say it's my fault, I'm good. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like. Or that's if, not if, if I, if that's I, not yeah, everybody. and if yeah. I say like it's my fault on like a part of it, I can still blame somebody else. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? It's like nah, like even with that little, we ain't got to get into it. But even with that little situation, you know what I'm saying that mm-hmm. I was in, mm-hmm. yeah. like for the longest, it was just like, man, forget that. I don't care what y'all saying. Buff that. That was wrong. Yeah. She was wrong. You know what I'm yeah. saying? But yeah. I was, I would be like, oh well, you know, I of course I wasn't a perfect person. But she was horrible. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it just it that, that wasn't okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, I like it took, it. I but like it took a while for me to be like, nah, you shouldn't even done that in the first place. Or you like you played a part in it, huh? Yeah, like it just I shouldn't have. She shouldn't have been out there. 
you know what I'm saying? Like I should just I should just went by myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and, yeah, 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 yeah. and we might we might cover that on a whole nother you know what I'm saying? Oh, but so y'all know what I'm Patreon. talking about. That's yeah. a heck of a story. Yeah, no, that's a story story. Because I was definitely about to ask about grudges, but no. Yeah. That's, but, that's later. Yeah, yeah, we can talk about that later. Okay, but okay, 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 but okay. but yeah, like I it took a while for me to be like, nah, you was just wrong and you were scared. And it's okay to be scared. Mm-hmm. You know what you I'm know saying? What? You know what I'm saying? You you know, and it, it's it's okay to say that you thought you knew everything and you just needed that to make you feel like you you took care of somebody. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And so you can say, Oh, I did all of this. Yeah. I got all of this going. You know what I'm saying? So look at me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like that was a that was a big thing. So whenever I finally was like, All right, I was wrong, I'd never do that again. Like and I really came to peace with it it wasn't although there was things that happened, it wouldn't have happened. If I would have just been honest with myself yeah, and been like, yeah. nah, like yeah. I just need either either no, this ain't the right time to move, or no, I shouldn't do this and I can do this by myself. That's like what, I didn't have a confidence to be by myself. Okay, 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 okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like that yeah, was yeah. the thing. Like I yeah. needed I needed a crutch yeah. in a way. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. So yeah, that was that was a big thing. Bro. That's what I was about to say. I didn't want to get into it, but I was about to say a lot of those lessons like about me not being the man I thought I was. A lot of that came from women. Like women I dealt with. Well, that's what men do everything you know for, saying? for the most part. I remember one, yeah. I remember one woman one time, she said, bro, you a dictator. You just, because you say it nice, it ain't dictating. Yeah. And I was mm. just like, dang. That's tough. Interesting. She's yeah. like, just because you say it nice, that don't mean it ain't, you know, manipulative. Yeah. It ain't It ain't my way. Or yeah. No way. yeah. She's like, you manipulative, but you say it in a nice way, but you still manipulative. Yeah. And I was like, man. That, hey. that, that would have hurt, but I, hey, yeah, hey, you kind of got to sit back. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I was say, yeah, that would have made me sit back. Like, I was like, dang. I was like, yeah. I don't think you're wrong. Yeah. Hey, yeah. hey. You know, uh-huh. you know, yeah. it's like you can't argue that. You just, I, I, you just gotta, you kind of sit back and be like, I yeah. mean, I didn't have no yeah, words. I, I didn't, I didn't have no words. Just yeah. Sit back and process that. Just I, you that. just hit it with that. Mm. Mm. That's like yeah. okay. okay, okay, yeah. I like, I like, I get that. Yeah, that one is a man. We're yeah. the Patreon. We're yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> we're yeah. talking about that, but no, man. Um, but I guess just to bring it full circle, you know, like. You watch somebody graduate high school, somebody had a 29th birthday, you mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like somebody that's entering life and somebody that's in life, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And it made me wonder, yeah. like, how much did Lee have to learn to get to where he had? You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Like, what's on the cusp of my little cousin as far as learning? Like, because mm-hmm. yeah. they about to go through a multitude. I'm about to say that. I feel like that's like, when are you, they like, prepared. Yeah, it, like it happened you... the same weekend. So it was like, mm-hmm. you know. Yeah, because I think that 18 to. The... 23, 23, 24, 25, 25, yeah. 25, that's when you learn. Wait, 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 it's 18 to 23 and then there's like, well, because nah, that's when your life constantly changes. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. I feel like you There's, don't get your first ounce of stability to about 25. Yeah, you're right. Maybe 23, depending on what you majored in in school. But, but yeah. 25, 26 for the most, yeah, for, for, think, for the general public. Yeah, I think G and Pop. I think, yeah, I think 25, 26 is when you kind of like, it's you've sh- experienced enough to be like, okay, this is like, that's when you start I got to get a, a little stable. A good, yeah, 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 I got a good feeling of it. Because I remember leading up to my 20, I was like, okay, I'm about to stop BSing. You know what I'm saying? Same. About to stop BSing. Like, yeah. Life real now. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, yeah, because you, up until that point, you might literally change environments or move every year of your life. Yeah. That's why I say. I literally did that. About 25 ish, you might get a little stable. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah man. But, um, no, this is. So ever it's an ever learning. Well, I might say that was a really good point. question, man. Yeah. Well, you know, it's just you know you think about that, and then yeah. like you put life into perspective, right? You know, yeah. I'm, I'm, we hitting them big ages now. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, 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 like we've lived some life outside of like high school, so it's yeah. like we got stuff to go off of. So yeah. every now and then, it's good to just see like where you think you at. You know? Yeah. You know. And what you've learned. Yeah. yeah. Did you apply that knowledge? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Do you got that clear mental picture? There we go. No. We got anything? Y'all got any birthday? Any any other things y'all want to talk about? Mm-mm. Huh? Mm-mm. Denver in five? Probably. Five and no money? Five, 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 six. Oh, I don't want to talk about it. I ain't touching it. Okay. I ain't touching it either. But yeah, That's man, this has been episode 113 of the Transferable Experience Podcast. Like always, remember to do all the things on all the things, and we'll be back next week. Yep. <laughs>